Hi guys, this is Sadek from Rodman.com and now we have got the new Keybox XML file that will help you pass the strong test with ease. Let me show you. The new files I'm using have the size of 13.07 KB. This is the file. And you can either get the file by asking me via the email in the articles comment section over here at the bottom. Go to the bottom over here and add your request in the comment section. I will then email you the file personally. Or you may do one more thing. You may also use my Keybox XML module. If your phone is currently obtained root, in that case, you flash our module so let me show you this is my model guide go here the latest version is a version 1.5 of the keybox module so get the model from here flash it onto your phone and then also flash a few other files which you might be aware of the you assistant that is next and tricky stove lenderly fork install these modules all other steps are given here only in my article so first get the model from here when that is done also get the files from this article or from here the steps are shown here Flash all these modules. When that is done, do a restart, and that is it. So I have all the modules on my phone. You could see over here. I just need a, a keybox file to be flashed. So hit the plus icon. Okay, let me show you first off. Let me remove the module from here. Let's remove the module. Delete. And it's gone as you could see. Let's flash the module now. So go to the app, your APATS, KSU, or Magisk. Then flash all the other modules which is given in my article. Open my article over here, and you could see a list of all the modules. To flash in the Magisk APATS or KSU. So this is for the, you could see Magisk APATS and KSU in case of Magisk. Let me show you the articles, steps and the videos are shown here. LS pose is optional, you must skip that. Shamikov, Lindegrade, Fix and Fork, Fix or Fork, Judges Assistant, Tricky Store and that is it. Then you have the KSU Web UI app as well. And then the Tricky Store add-on module, all the links are given over here. So flash those modules and then get the job done as you could see. This is the add-on module and KSU Web UI app. So steps are given here. Once you flash all these modules, then get my keybox module and flash it onto your phone. So just give me a second downloads. This is my module. It's now flash. Tap on reboot. And once that is complete, you should now have the keybox file in the location automatically, which is the data editable tricky store. The file will be placed automatically on that location. No need to do anything manually. So just give it a few more seconds for the phone to boot to the OS. And after that, the mod will be up and running in the APATS KSU Magisk and then you have the keybox file as well in this directory automatically. Let me show you that and we are inside the OS now. So launch the KSU app first off. Module is up and running fine. And now let's see the over here data database tricky store. You could see we have got our keybox file. So now we should pass the strong test as well. And let me see we are passing the strong test. But if your phone is currently not rooted, in that case, you cannot use the module, which is quite obvious. So for example, let's say we have a custom ROM, which is currently not rooted. I might be having a custom ROM over here. Just give me a second. Okay, this is the ROM. I guess it's the C Android ROM, Android 16 base. So in that case, what you can do now is no need to flash or root your phone. Simply go to your ROM set settings, spoofing section, which is over here and then load the keybox file. But before that, you may ask the file from my articles comment section. I will share the file by email. Once you've got the file, place the file onto your phone, anyway will do. And then just first of type on update PIF, which once that is complete, then choose your keybox file. Just give me a, this is a file and it's keybox is now loaded. Let's now see the result as well. And we're passing the strong test in this as well. Both the, you could see the non-root and root both are working for rooted phone. Simply use my module to get the job done for non-rooted phones. If you're on a custom ROM, then simply load the file from the ROM section of Keybox load, which is over here, as you could see, and get the job done. So guys, that's all from this video. If you have any query, let me know in the comment section. And thanks a lot for watching.